Women's water polo is coming to Fresno State for the first time ever. On Thursday, Fresno State introduced its first coach, Natalie Benson. Building a new program and making a new program relevant nationally is something that I find very, very intriguing professionally. Truly building a program with athletes that I bring in and establishing a culture is, is valuable to me. And so I think it's, it's professionally engaging and exciting. Benson is a former Olympian medalist as a player, a U.S. Water Polo Hall of Famer, and now the initial architect of Fred State Women's Water Polo that will begin competition in the spring of 2018. Today we're hiring an exceptional coach to uh, create our new water polo team for them and for the young women uh, from all around the state and beyond. Phenomenal coach, phenomenal athlete, one of the best water polo players ever in the sport. We're honored to have her here today. Benson has spent the past three years coaching at Marist College in New York, but of all of her experiences, Benson's ties to the club water polo scene in Southern California and coaching the 16 and under junior national team might be the most beneficial to Fresno State in bringing in top level talent. Collegiate water polo is a big deal for these kids, and, and a lot of the reason why they play 16 and under nationals is to go to college, to be seen by collegiate coaches. Those kind of kids will do very well in a Division I program that's very competitive. Fresno State will compete in the Golden West Conference, which includes the likes of San Diego State, Pacific, and Santa Clara. Benson is optimistic that the Bulldogs' startup program could compete for a championship within the first five years. There's a certain maturity process that they have to go through, so I don't want to also put these unrealistic expectations on a first-year student-athlete. The same I wouldn't on any freshman, even if it's an established program. Um, you'd want to make sure that they come in and they're comfortable with their role as well. Um, so I think realistically within three years we should be very, very competitive.